so good morning all of you we are looking at a jee 2002 question here so what is given here is that uh, there is a trolley here which is moving along the y axis so this is our x axis here and uh, this is our y axis so this trolley is moving along the y axis with speed root 3 minus 1 meters per second when the trolley just starts to move the line joining this uh, body and the trolley takes an angle 45 degrees with the x axis now what happens is subsequently this ball here is projected in the xy plane and it hits the trolley so just let us have a look so this is projected in the xy plane and uh, and it hits the trolley in the first question what is asked is if we are looking from the frame of the trolley let us say you are a person sitting on the trolley what is the angle made by the velocity vector of the ball with the x axis in this frame if we are looking in the frame of the trolley the initial position of the body with respect to the trolley is here right and uh, the final position is here right till it was here and finally it was here initially it was here finally it was here means in the frame of the trolley its velocity vector should have been in this direction right so no need to do any calculation this vector here you know this vector here makes an angle 45 degrees with the x axis right so directly we can write the answer for the first question a as theta equals to 45 degrees in the second question he has asked what is the speed of the ball with respect to the surface if phi equals to 4 theta by 3 so in the b part phi equals to 4 times theta is a pi by 4 divided by 3 so he's saying phi equals to pi by 3 let us just draw this is a trolley here and uh, this is a ball here the velocity of this ball was at an angle pi by 3 in the frame of the trolley this ball has gone and met the trolley at an angle pi by 4 so in the frame of the trolley the velocity of this ball will be velocity of this ball minus velocity of trolley so velocity of trolley direction is in this direction minus velocity of so minus velocity of trolley will be in this direction the resultant of these two vectors right velocity of ball and velocity of trolley is along this line which is pi by 4 okay so what can we say is that the vertical the resultant of this vector if it is at an angle pi by 4 its vertical and horizontal components are equal right so i'm just writing down that here so the horizontal component v cos pi by 3 right and the net vertical component is v sin pi by 3 minus root 3 minus 1 okay so this is velocity vector v angle pi by 3 this is one vector and this is a second vector minus v trolley so the resultant of these two i am taking uh, if it is inclined at an angle pi by 4 the horizontal and the vertical components are equal so we can just write cos pi by 3 is v by 2 equals to v root 3 by 2 Minus root three plus one. Root three minus one equals to v root three by two minus v by two. So this is uh, root three minus one equals to v by two into root three minus one. These both will get cancelled. Take two that side. We get v equals to two meters. Get the value of v equals to two meters per second, which is the answer. Let's have a look at the diagram once again. 